I'm Loy. Today my class is Ting, and I want to know more about your country, South Africa. Could you tell us where South Africa is? South Africa is at the southern end of the continent of Africa, which lies to the west of Taiwan. At the moment, South Africa is having winter approach because the country is in the southern hemisphere, unlike Taiwan, which is in the northern hemisphere, and summer is fast approaching. How long does it take you from South Africa to Taiwan? It takes about 24 hours. No, it takes about 48 hours to travel from South Africa to Taiwan. Um, I left South Africa on a Friday morning, made my way from Jeffreys Bay to Port Elizabeth, took the plane from Port Elizabeth to Johannesburg, took a flight from Johannesburg to Dubai, and then from Dubai to Taipei. So I left my home on a Friday morning and I arrived in Taipei on the Saturday night. So it's a long way to come from South Africa to Taiwan. Taipei 101 is the most famous landmark in Taiwan. When we visit South Africa, which landmark would you want to show us? My favorite place to visit. South Africa has so many beautiful landmarks. My favorite place to visit is Cape Town because of course the, the mountain, Table Mountain, is so completely, completely flat. And it is a beautiful landmark to see. One can take a cable car up to the top and then you survey the entire Bay of Cape Town. It's definitely one of the top cities in the world. Much like Sun Moon Lake is one of the top attractions in Taiwan, the city of Cape Town and Table Mountain is one of the top attractions in South Africa. What about in South Africa? I heard that South Africa abounds lots of diamonds. Is it true? South Africa indeed has many, many, many diamonds. We have diamond mines, we have gold mines, we have platinum mines, and a num the country is mineral rich. But what it is also rich in is wild animals. We have, for instance, the big five, um, which is lion, elephant, rhinos, cheetahs, and buffaloes. And when you come to visit South Africa, you will go to a game park, such as the Kruger National Park, and if you are fortunate, you will see all five of those animals in a single day. What is the difference between people in Taiwan and the people in South Africa? There is a real diversity in the people of South, in the people of South Africa. I'm happy to say, though, that both South Africans and Taiwanese are very, very friendly. But I think what we have differently in South Africa is that we have people of many cultures. Our population consists of black South Africans, colored South Africans, white Indian and even Asian South Africans. That is why South Africa is often referred to as the rainbow nation. In conclusion, could you tell us how you feel about your country? I love my country. Just like Taiwanese folks love Taiwan, I love South Africa. I love her people, I love her food, I love her beautiful scenery. I love the fact that in South Africa we speak so many different languages and yet we are one. Please feel free to come and visit our country anytime you like. Thank you for your answer. It is our honor to talk with you here.